What's going on guys, Sledgehammer70 here, and I am kind of excited today. So, I've talked about it a lot in quite a few of my other videos, some of my exhaust videos, and even my uh, June mod update videos, but finally, my Stainless Works new MPP AFM Delete exhaust has shown up. And today I want to do a video, it arrived yesterday, but um, I got home really late last night and I just was not able to do a video. So uh, I'm on my lunch break right now creating this video and I want to unbox it, kind of check it out, make sure all the parts are there and everything is is how I ordered it. So you guys are literally watching this as I see it for the first time. So here we go, check it out. Okay, so let's open this bad boy up. Washers, little lanyard. Ooh, what's that little doohickey? Don't know what that is. Lots of stuff in here. Set that to the side. Don't think I'm gonna need my knife any further. So let's set that to the side. So. Lots of uh, clamps to hold all the pieces together. I see stuff. Wow. Oh, this is gonna open things up. So yeah, so this is the part of, and I can't see the camera, so. This is actually one of the pipes with the active fuel management delete. So you'll see it has the proper mounting hardware. There's no valve, nothing in there. See right through it. So this will eliminate that. So sweet, got that right. And as you can see, it's three inch pipes all the way through versus some of the smaller systems out there. Wow, this is a beast. It's not that heavy, shockingly. So they wrap the tips on there. You can see the MPP system. So you can see the one valve, and I don't know if this is the left or right, they mark the other pieces, but I'm sure it would be self-explanatory lining it up. Um, oh, that looks not fun. Looks like a little bit of damage in shipping. Yep, same here. I have to get some tools to pull it out. So uh, shipping-wise, it's unfortunate, but it looks like there's uh, this got dented up. I'm just, can hammer that out and get it in the proper place, but that's unfortunate. Same with this side, looks like a little bit of a buckle on the corner here. But again, it's got the MPP. I'll set these to the side. So again, this is the cat back system. So here's the right side, it's even marked, right side, for the active fuel management delete. And again, let's see, wow, this went through some interesting uh, shipping woes. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that, I'm assuming not, but. Ooh, the coveted X-pipe. So this piece looks fine on both sides, but here's the Stainless Works X-pipe section. And you can actually see some of the technology. I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but you can see they they got some stuff in there. Um, interesting to understand what that does. I'm assuming it, it either eliminates drone or something. But uh, there is a a piece in there that's welded in place on this part of the pipe. And for those of you guys out there who know what it is, let me know. Some adapter pieces. So this is coming up. Yep, this is the right side. And 
assuming this is the left side, yeah. So this part here is what slides into your cat where the catalytic converter hooks up. So bam, that's all the pieces. There's a lot of pieces. I wonder if I could fit this all in my trunk when I go down to the place that has the deck where I'm gonna be installing it. <laughs> we shall find out. So but there you go. So that was the unboxing. Um, I'm gonna say first and foremost, the quality seems really good. The packaging and shipping does look like it needs some help. Stainless Works, if you guys can figure that out for other people ordering your product, some of those flanges are pretty jacked up. Um, I don't know, I mean, I know when I've ordered exhausts in the past from my other cars, they came in that, like that spray foam that rises and fills in all the cracks and kind of kept it really safe, so. Um, I mean, it's nothing that's not fixable on my end, but you don't really want to have to do that after spending this kind of money for an exhaust, so. But yeah, uh, super excited about the product, regardless of some of the shipping issues. Again, there there's nothing too dramatic where I don't think it's gonna be impossible to fix or adjust properly. Um, but outside of that, man, I'm, I'm pumped to see this on the car, basically hear this on the car, but you see the size of the pipes, it's, it's pretty awesome. So, you know, take one more look. Oh, it's so pretty. It's gonna be so awesome. So, thanks for checking out the video. Stay tuned for my install guide, my review, dyno results, all that stuff is coming. So, as always, I appreciate all the watches, comments, likes, shares, subscribes. If you guys are interested in learning more about the Stainless uh, Works content um, on the 2016 Camaro SS, hit that subscribe button. I got a lot of videos coming. We're gonna start doing them in the weeks ahead. Um, but also, you know, anything that I may have talked about, um, linking to previous videos, it's always in the right hand corner. Click on that uh, icon if you don't see it. It's probably just not available on your platform through YouTube, but check it out. And uh, until next time, guys, I'll see you on the road.